Hi, I'm Ian, a developer support engineer here at 8th Wall. In this tutorial, we'll learn how to add animations to our 8th Wall experiences. There are two primary techniques for integrating animations. One involves animating the model within a 3D software, followed by importing the 3D model into 8th Wall. The alternative is through programming, which involves modifying the positions, dimensions, and rotations of the model in a procedural manner. Method 1, which involves animating models directly in a 3D software, enables us to bake animations into our model. There is some assumed knowledge of 3D softwares with this approach, but it provides a high degree of control. Such control encompasses the ability to bake physics simulations, character animations, and the utilization of bones. Controversially, creating animations programmatically doesn't inflate the file size and affords us to flexibility to make the animations responsive to the user's interaction. This includes moving objects based on user inputs, rotating elements in response to specific triggers, and so on. In this example, we will be working on A-Frame, but you should be able to accomplish this in 3.js, Babylon, or Play Canvas. Let's start by creating a simple animation in Blender. Use the default cube in your scene, adjust the position upwards until its base aligns perfectly with the ground surface. This step ensures that the cube's base is accurately situated at y equals 0 coordinate within your eighth wall scene. Create a couple keyframes making the cube move, scale, and rotate. Make sure you have your keyframes set on the first frame, 0, and the last frame of your timeline. For more details on how to animate, and set keyframes in Blender, please reference the links in the description or search online once you have your animations ready. Let's export it as a GLB file. Here is a simple box animation I animated, which changes position, rotation, and scale. Let's clone the A-frame world effects template and upload our model into our assets folder. Finally, let's load our model to the scene by adding A assets. The scene should be ready but if we test it, we won't see the animations running. To enable animations for 3D models, we need to include an additional library called A-Frame Extras. This library has a component to handle model animations called Animation Mixer. Let's start by adding this library. Open your head.html file and put the following line to load the Extras library. Always check on the A-Frame side for the latest version of this library. To play an animation, we just need to add the Animation Mixer module. If we preview our project again, we should see our animation playing. For the second approach, we can animate the box through the A-Frame Animation component. The A-Frame Animation component provides an assortment of properties that facilitate the creation of animations, which we can be as complex as we desire. However, to begin with, we'll undertake a simpler task having a box move and scale continuously in a loop. The basic animation structure is composed of property, the property to animate, from the initial value at which to start the animation, to the target value at the end of the animation, and then the duration, how long in milliseconds each cycle of the animation is. Let's create a simple animation that moves the model in the x-axis by one. This will move your model from 0 to 1 in 2 second duration. You can also set the animation to loop by adding loop true or even adding an easing mode to make the animation slow down at the end. Easing, ease out quad. You can have several animations by using the property name animations followed by two underscores and a new name. Let's create an animation that moves a model by changing scale and rotation. Great. You have successfully deployed multiple programmatic animations in your project. Now, the real magic happens when you start combining both baked and programmatic animations into eighth wall projects with user interactions such as click events. Thanks for watching, and we can't wait to see what you create with eighth wall.